Hey, this is Jack with Two Brothers Adventures. Gonna do a video on the Rotopax mounting systems. So what we have here is we have a Rotopax first aid and preparedness kit, a couple of their one gallon fuel canisters, and a couple of their one gallon uh, potable water canisters. But what we're gonna show you is the mounting kits that we have and kind of give you a look at how these work and how they operate with the Rotopax system. Okay, so the first one we have is pretty much the standard non-locking one here and this one's all set up with a base plate on it. Each one of these comes in a pack with a base plate that mounts flush to any hard surface that will hold the weight of the canister that you're putting on there. It comes with a bag of hardware which consists of a nut with a square locking Thing there that goes into the plate to go through your hard surface. It comes with a washer for each one and a nice nylon locking nut. So that's a really nice thing. So as you can see there's four holes for those there. So you mount that onto your base plate. Before you do that you put your put your bolts through this way. They have locking washers. I just don't have one here to come with it to go through here and it locks your mount on like that and that's how it locks it onto your flat surface like that. That's what we have set up here. So basically what this does is once it's mounted onto your flat surface like that you'll simply put your container over the over the thing like that and you'll screw this down And as you can see there's two pieces here and there's actually a little dimple right here on each side and there's a little dimple on the bottom of this thing and that actually kind of locks onto there. So you can screw this down as tight as you want to hold that so it won't rattle and then what you do is you actually turn this one and that puts the final pressure on there and locks that down. And as you can see that is not going to move on those dimples. I cannot move that at all. So that just totally locks that on there. So then you'd be locked onto your flat surface here, and then you could mount that on anything that would hold the weight of that thing. And then to take it off, you would simply undo this. So you can turn that, and then it just slides right off, just like that. And this works for all their different types of packs that they have. They have packs of kerosene or diesel fuel preparedness packs like this. They all have the same locking system. So when you get a mount put on the side of your trailer, the wall of your garage, um, the better your pickup, you can change all of these different packs out depending on what you want. Um, if you fit the, this is a two gallon size, a one gallon size, any type like that. Then we can move over here. This is basically the same mount but it has a locking feature. So if you want to lock this onto your vehicle, your trailer, your wall, something like that, so that nobody can, can uh, help themselves to it, this is the exact same thing but with the lock in here. It comes with two nice keys. And the cool thing about this lock is, if you can see here, it actually pulls this whole part out. So that's going to be very um, tamper resistant when it's down inside of there. You slip that down in there, take your key out, and there's really nothing to, to cut or, or pry or do anything with and then that locks that from turning so that it will not be able to to be pulled out of your out of your thing. So once you get that in there and you get that turned and that's locked you won't be able to undo the tension and take that off. So that is a really nice thing. Uh, there's also a way to mount several of these together and that's what these are. These are the extensions and I'll go ahead and set that up and I'll show you how that works. Okay, so as you can see here, I have three one gallon containers all hooked together. They're very sturdy. As you can see on the back, this is where it would be mounted to the flat surface where you would mount the mount and then it's locked down tight here and none of these will come apart. This is a very strong system. It's not going anywhere. So what this does is if you want this top one off, you just release your tension, turn it, slide it off, and this is actually the extension part here. So now you turn this, 
take the tension off of this one, rotate that, pull that off, and then the same with this one. You rotate this, take your tension off, and rotate that, and pull your last one all the way off. Now, as you can see, this is the extension part. This is the second extension part. You can basically add as many of these as you want by putting the extension pieces on there, whatever you think your mounting um, point can hold. But it's as simple as putting the first one on. You want to rotate your locking thing onto there and then adjust the tension with this piece. And there is a little ball down in there that you can hear snap into place to hold that so that it doesn't move when you get the tension on there that you want. Stack your next one down over that. Put your locking one over the over the two little things there and then put your tension on. As you can hear there's a positive snap when you get that on there. So that locks that down as you can see. It's not going anywhere. And put your third one on, turn your first one on, and adjust your final tension with this one. Now this final one, we could put the locking one on out here if we wanted to. And it's really easy. The really nice thing about these things is they're so versatile. So let's say you want to leave this with a buddy or leave it in camp and you want to switch this out. All you would do is just quickly unscrew this and change the configuration. And then you can go down to running only two or running only one, throw these in the glove box under the seat, whatever. So as you can see, it's kind of limitless in what you can do with these mounting brackets. They'll work for all the different types of rotopacks, things that they have out there. If you don't think that one of these would work for your application, please go check out their website because they have other mounting mounts available for specific, some of them for specific applications and different things. These are just the two that we happen to have that we kind of wanted to show you the basics of how they work. So go check out rotopacks.com and this is an excellent product and I think they'll have something for you.